Welcome to ITSP. This is Vivek. So this is 10 minute video series related to Postgres. So now today's topic is uh, like operators. And next two videos I have uploaded and that YouTube channel, you can go and watch that. Uh, so this is the particular thing is the like operator. That two videos is going more than 10 minutes. It's okay. Go and watch that. But right now I'm that preparing that within the 10 minutes, I will try to complete this. So this is the like operator. Like operator is nothing but used for the matching purpose, like pattern matching. And it is commonly used for select statements where clauses like when you try to filter the specific data site. So, right. so now here you can see that the definition is there. Like operator is used to perform the pattern matching within the string value. It's the commonly used for the select statement with where clause to filter rows based on the specified pattern. Brief note along with that explanation we have. Okay. So now the, using the like operator, we can uh, perform the uh, syntax is this. The select column one, column two from the table name. This is the simple. Up to this is simple. Where clause we seen. Okay, where clause you can pass that uh, your up to this machine, but this is the new. Okay, so now we will learn this. So like just pass the like keywords and pattern, which pattern you want. Okay, so we have uh, some patterns that I will show you. The pattern can be included wildcard characters. Okay, these two wildcard characters we have in that pattern. First is the percentile, second one is the underscore. So percentile is match any sequence of character. Like if you pass that percentile with that and, I will show you, don't worry. With that and of character like this, okay. Like this, it means when uh, at the starting of that, yes, if any uh, character is there in that uh, database, that data will come, okay. At the end, starting like that, at the end of S yes is there, then that data will come. If you at the mid, if you having fix, if in the in the table in the column, if yes is there, if you passing percentile yes, percentile yes and percentile yes like that, if any uh, column in that which particular column you want to get the data, if any data is related to yes is there anywhere, the data will come right. Same explanation is there where column name like abc percentile right so matches any value in column that start with abc right data will come where clause name like start with the percentile and xyz matches any value in the column that ends with xyz that ends with xyz that that data data will come where close like percentile Def and percentile match any value column name or any value name value in the column that contains def anywhere in that particular column anywhere def is there that row will come okay where close name like a underscore c match any value in the column that start with a and with c and has exactly one character in between then that data will come. Like this for example, this is the case insensitive, case sensitive. If you pass A instead of A, like operator, like operator is case sensitive. If you don't want to use case sensitive, just, just use I like. This is the one more operator in uh, Postgres is there. So use like or as like, right? Right, so you can use this. So here, just we created one table. Uh, table name is employee we created, ID, and ID uh, sal salary, the primary key, uh, name, barrier, job title, okay? After that, we insert this data. So let's go over PZ admin, okay? Uh, so desktop, there is a PZ admin here. Just create one database, okay? Uh, Post testing 10 minute series. Notes 10 minute series. 10 minute post grace. Right. We have database 10 minute. Okay. Perfect. We created inside the schema. 
inside the table. Is there any table? Is there not table? Just open, select this. Open a query tool. Uh, copy over uh, query. Select Control C and paste it and select this and execute this. Now query returns successfully in one two second. If you want to see just to refresh once and you can see employee table is the right now you can see open a one query tool so i can show you just you can see select how to show all the data which are available in the database in the employee table select a star from employee a star from employee employee okay Let's see if there any data is there. Employee is not there. Employees is there. Just select this, execute. No, ID is empty, name is empty, job title is empty. Just copy this data. I want this data. Okay, copy this and uh, paste it here. Okay, execute and this name, job title. Okay okay only uh id will automatically is generated let's see select this execute this id is one two three four is automatic generated no this is the automatic generation is there okay yeah serial if you use a serial then the serial number will automatically generate how many record you inserted that uh, based on the your record the data will now next is uh, first Select all employee where start with J. How many employee start with J? That employee I want to select. So now select. So what is the syntax? Select star. You can use this star from employee table, employees table. Okay. What is that? Uh, like. Like. Select the star from like. Start with J. So first we pass a J. This is the case sensitive. Case sensitive. Let's see. Case sensitive proof is there. Just percentile. Let's see. Is there any data is coming or not? No. Like is uh -huh. okay. 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 Like. Where name employee where okay. You can pass with that where. No? So where where. Uh, where name column name also we need to pass just select this and execute this now here is there any data is coming not coming now? so pass or capital j this is the case sensitive so control z okay copy this and uh, paste it pass the j and select this okay execute not this one, this just deleted. Okay. Now here you can see the data is coming only two record is there. Only two record, John Don and Jane Smith is there. Okay. Two records is there. So up to this is clear. Now next is our select all employees whose name ends with yen. Select all employees whose name ends with yes. So let's see. Select star from employee employees where name where is column name where name like like operator pass that ends with na so first we percentile then start with yes let's see how many employees there okay now no employees is there with that end with yes name okay no employee is there with that end so now select star from employee employees where where name like and with single quotes and with uh -huh, like yen i want to show yen and with yen small left just pass this and select this these two records will come mike and alice mike and alice will come so now next is yeah you can see the select all employees whose job title contains softwares like 
I want to show. I want to show whose job title is content software. So when you go with the fixed character you want to search, then use percentile, then particular string, then percentile, right? Select star from employee is where name I want to like name okay in that name uh, not a name where job title underscore was that column name job title like if job title is containing any percentile software software right that employee I want that employee I want just click this no, no software is containing. Why? Because it's, it's capital letter is containing. Na? So just for capital, then select this here. Only two records are there, which is job title is software engineer and software developer. So now next is select all employee whose name has exactly five characters. Okay whose name is exactly five characters. If you want to perform this, so we use one, we have wildcard character like underscores. So now if you have a name as with the select star from employees, where name like which character? Like five characters, five, pass that only five underscores. Just select this. Let's see if any five characters is there. No, 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 no. Five characters. With that, uh, I start with five characters. Okay, percentile. Use it. Select this if having percent. Why is this? Not. Uh, employees. Select a star from employees. Okay. Select this. Now here, you can see that five characters name is containing on that pipe right mm -hmm. no okay no containing five characters right let's see is three character is containing any name uh four characters four you can pass that four under the score four Let's execute. Not if you use percentile, then it will work, right? So use this, and here you can get the data. Right. So this is that. Now select all employees whose name start with J and end with E, and one character is only between this. So use that. Okay. So select star from employee where where name like character uh, start with j and having one character in between e right percentile right okay let's see not come why because employees there no data is there no data I just perform two is data is there no data is not coming but john is there in that case just was percentile okay uh just james is coming right here you can see percentile this if you select this data is not coming for him double quotes because james name james names is having two character between j and e that's why so that's all this is up to like character like character we completed so i will share these notes on this group you can check it which group just i want to show you uh, okay here you can go with FB. Okay, in the Facebook. In the Facebook, just go inside the iTrick study park. 
So in this group, you can get at this notes. Okay. So thank you. We will meet some next sessions.